You're the best thing that ever happened to me, baby. Thank you, baby. I love you so much. That's so sweet. I would be honored if you could have me first in my life. Like Lonnie Lynn. I'm so nervous. Will you marry me? From the moment I fell for you, I cannot imagine a life without you. I promise to always respect your needs, to accept you as you are. I will strive to always be kind, selfless, and trusting. The future I hope to create together will be one filled with excitement, wonder, anticipation, and joy. interrupt Jacob's class that he was in just to remind him, to tell him to ride the bus with the number SW10. Every day, I run around with Jacob riding SW10. I know. Uh, so I would do that because I was I felt, I was so scared to be without my brother. Right? I felt this sense of protection with Jacob. Kind of just an umbrella protection while with him. But soon, after Saturday, that protection is going to shift. And it warms my heart to know that that protection is going to shift to someone who makes Jacob the happiest he's ever been and the person he chose to do life with. That's Miss Lalani to everybody. I choose you. I choose you over and over and over. Without pause, without doubt, I'll just keep choosing you. Today seems like it's the start of a new journey, but I've already belonged to you for so long. Falling for you wasn't falling at all. It was walking into a house and knowing your home. I love you. Leilani, I love you so dearly. Not so very long ago, you were simply a dream and a prayer. The Lord has answered my prayer for on this special day, Leilani, you, my pride and joy, become my crown. I thank Jesus for the blessing of allowing me to share a life with you. Thank you for being who you are with me, with a future as bright as the promises made to us by God himself. I will care for you, protect you, while we walk in his path. I would lay down my life for you, my best friend, my true love. You're the most sexy and amazing human I know. I'm so excited I'm going to be walking down the aisle to you today. <clears throat> today is going to be best, the best day of my life because I will be I promise to shower you with unconditional love, to honor you each and every day, to laugh with you when times are good, to support you and be your rock when you are down, to guide you when you ask for direction, to challenge you to be the very best person that you can be, and to allow you to do the same for me. I look forward to being your biggest fan, your ever-present audience. I promise to remain loyal to you, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health until death do us part. I am asking the, the persons present here today to witness that I, Jacob Elton Duyon, take you, Leilani Linterio, to be my lawfully wedded wife.
Jacob, I knew from the moment that I laid my eyes on you that you were my husband. I can't explain it. I just, I felt it with every fiber in my being that God made you perfectly for me. Today we become one, and I'm so proud that I'll become your wife. I love you. I love everything about you. I love that your laugh makes me laugh. <laughs> I love that you always pursue Jesus and lead me to him daily. I love knowing that you will be the father of our children one day. I love that I get a kiss from you every time we stop at a red light. <laughs> I love that you're open to trying new things. I love your sense of adventure and the way you always brighten my day. I love that you are passionate, driven, and hardworking. Today, I want to make promises to you that I will always keep. I promise to never stop holding your hand. I promise to tell you every day how much I love you and appreciate all that you do for us. I want to grow old and spend the rest of my life with you. No words will ever express the feelings I have in my heart for you. You are God's plan all along, and I will forever give Him thanks and praise. You saved me not only as your partner, but as a God-fearing man who will be with you after this life. I'm sorry. I promise to never go to bed angry and to always honor you. I promise to love and support you in anything you do and to trust you as the head of our house. I promise to stand by your side while you face the world and listen to you when you speak. I promise to put God first in our marriage and to pray consistently during the good times and the bad. I promise to help shoulder our challenges and celebrate all of our little wins. I promise to love, respect, protect, and trust you to give you the best version of myself. For I know that together, we will build a life far better than any of us can imagine alone. I choose you. I choose you over and over and over. Without pause, without doubt, I'll just keep choosing you. Today seems like it's the start of a new journey, but I've already belonged to you for so long. Falling for you wasn't falling at all. It was walking into a house and knowing your home. I love you. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. As a representative of Jesus Christ before Almighty God, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, I now pronounce you one together. You are now husband and wife. And Jacob, you may now kiss your bride. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. and Mrs. Jacob Duyall.
for each other because they're so much alike in, in the right ways. They're very funny. They laugh at everything, and I love Jacob's laugh. Like, I laugh when I hear his laugh. It is the most unique laugh. So, I mean, I can hear him from across the river laughing. I mean, we, we're, we just love it. One, two, three, four.